Sup, y'all, yeah, bring you guys another video. Just bring you guys my post fight thoughts of the fight between Suso Cat Sorung v. Sai, the former WBC champ, versus Quantai Sitmore Sang. They fought over the weekend over in Thailand. Fight was shown live on the zone. You can actually watch the highlights here on YouTube on the zone, uh, the zone's official uh, YouTube channel at uh, the zone boxing. You can watch the highlights here. Pretty much sums up the fight. Uh, fight ended after three rounds uh, with uh, Secret Set Sorung Visai having his hands raised in the end. Uh, first things first, I just want to apologize for the late upload. Uh, I was out of town the past few days, so uh, I wasn't able to upload any post fight thought videos over the, for the fights that took place over the weekend, but I did watch it. And um, yeah, it was a pretty easy win for Rung Visai. He saw Rung Visai went out there and it. it Sid Marseille was pretty much just a punching bag moving around. I'm going to be honest, man. He was a punching bag. And uh, uh, Rung Visai was just pity patting, punching him. And, you know, uh, first few couple rounds were pity pat punches. And then the third round, that's when he started putting more weight to his punches. Hurt Sid Marseille. Sid Marseille took a knee. And, you know, Sid Marseille was just taking punch after punch. And I expected more from Sid Marseille. I actually thought he would go out swinging, but. In the end, he he just gave up, and uh, I guess Rung Visai was just too strong, too strong for Sid Marseille. So, you know, an, an easy win, easy win for uh, Rung Visai. Uh, with this win, he improves to 15 and five, one draw, 43 wins coming by way of knockout TKO now. Um, his three fights, three wins in a row since losing to Estrada in the rematch. And uh, Rung Visai, from what I've been reading, it looks like he wants the winner uh, before the rematch between Tocolatito and Estrada. Um, you know, he wanted the win of that fight. And as we all know now, Estrada ended up winning the third, the, the rematch between Estrada and Chocolatito. So, so Rung Visai wants that third fight against Estrada. Plus, if you guys don't know, Rung Visai is actually the mandatory challenger for the WBC title. So... Um, he's next in line for the WBC strap, which is currently held by Estrada. And I don't mind a third fight. I think a third fight makes sense. If, um, you know, Rung Visai can travel outside of Thailand, you know, why not? Let's see a third fight between so uh, Sri Saket, Sor Rung Visai versus Estrada. As for um, Sint Morsang, 38 years old now, losing this fight, losing 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 5 out of his 8 fights, last 8 fights. Maybe it's time to retire for Sid Marsang. And he looked old here, man. He looked really old. Um he looked old, he looked slow, he 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 just wasn't even in the fight. Like he showed up to just get paid pretty much. <laughs> so so yeah, I think it's time for Sid Marsang to retire. Uh the rest of the card was okay. Um honestly the rest of the card didn't really keep me up that much. Uh I barely remember it. Um, so, <laughs> but, you know, hopefully, uh, Soru Mubisai ends up being in a bigger event, bigger fight than this, because, uh, he's definitely levels beyond guys that he's been fighting lately. The guys he's been fighting lately over in Thailand, guys like, uh, Sintmar Sang and, uh, Jomar Fajardo, and even, um, I'm not wondering who's a former champion, you know, Rung Mubisai is... It's just levels ahead, and he deserves to be in the big fights, the big money fights, uh, the championship fights, and hopefully that's what we see next for Rung Visai. I, I want a third fight against Estrada. I don't mind it at all. It, well, it doesn't even have to be Estrada. I just hope it's a big fight against a big name. That's all I'm hoping for. So, anyway, if you saw the fight, let me know what did you think about it. Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. And like always, have a great day. All right, thanks.